everybody so I wanted to make a video really quickly and let you guys know that I have decided to go back to nursing school so I don't know how many of you may know this or not but I was previously in an RN program it didn't work out I made a video about it already so if you want to go check that out you totally can um, that was an RN program I am now going into an LVN program I'm really excited about it because I know that it's a good school because my husband went there and it sounds like a lot of the problems that I had at my previous school I shouldn't have here at this new school so and I'm also really excited that it's only a year because a year in my last program really just like flew by and so I'm really excited I'm just really excited and I'm really excited for everything and I'm excited for it to be over with and all at the same time. Um, I kind of decided to go back because we just can't live off of my husband's paycheck only. Um, I guess like in our society it just doesn't it just doesn't work like that anymore. Um, if you have kids, even if you don't have kids, you really need like a two income household. It's just and I don't Whenever growing up, I was really like, I just want to be a stay-at-home mom and wife, and and that was cool back then, but we just can't really live like that anymore. And I know that as a nurse, I would always have a job. My husband is always going to have a job. So, yeah, I'm just really excited, and I've been watching a ton of YouTube videos and trying to learn from maybe mistakes that I made last time. So... Whenever I go school shopping, I will definitely be doing like a nursing school haul. I'm really excited about it. I'm so I'm so excited about it. It's about mid-September right now, and my program will start early November. So I have a little bit of time to get everything together and ready. And yeah, so I am currently just getting all of my transcripts together and like my physical and my um, my, my drug test and just all the documents that you need to start nursing school there's kind of a lot especially if you're um, transferring credits into the program and there's a few there's only two that I'm trying to transfer it's um, growth and development and math I'm just trying to get those two out of the way because I just feel like I don't know <laughs> I am gonna retake my anatomy and physiology one and two I've already taken anatomy and physiology one and two and micro, but I felt like I didn't really get like the best knowledge, education out of it. And so um, my husband really recommended that I reconsider taking anatomy and physiology one and two over again. So I've decided to go ahead and do that. And yeah, so I've already applied for my CCDS. If you guys don't know what that is, it's, um, like government assistance and helping with childcare. I don't know if you guys know how much childcare is, but it's pretty ridiculous. I'm shocked that these places are allowed to charge as much as they do. And with, I have two boys that um, I would be putting in the program, so it's just because you're putting in an additional child does not mean that you're necessarily gonna get a discount or that big of a discount. Sometimes they'll say, oh yeah, $10 off. Well. If I'm paying $1,200 a month, $10 just really isn't, you know, a big discount at all. So the last time I had received CCDS, I think we still had to pay like $540 a month, a month, and so it's still a pretty heavy hit. But yeah, so I've already applied for it, I've already done, and like I already know how everything works, so I already knew to like print my application off the computer turn it in and I already know when the documents are going to be due and like you have to wait for your packet in the mail and then your documents are due. Last time I didn't know and so I had like collected everything that I was told that I needed and I took it straight to the office and like it was just a bunch of time wasted basically and so this time around um this time around I just kind of knew like what to do with I've already spoken with uh, the babysitter that watched my kids the last time and she agreed to watch them again. Once again, that's still a heavy hit because we still have to pay her too. Um, and so I kind of decided that <clears throat> right now was the best time for me to go back to nursing school. If we wait for us to get a house and if I'm working, you know, at a retail or 
grocery store or something like that and then we move into a house well then my husband is gonna rely on that income to help with the bills and then if I quit that and then try to go to school it's just gonna be way harder on both of us and so we've kind of made the decision that if I'm gonna go back right now is the time to do so that's where I'm at right now I just wanted to kind of update you guys and let you guys know I definitely want to be doing nursing video so if you guys have any ideas of what kind of videos you want to see from me then just let me know comment down below um, but yeah thanks for watching bye